Have you ever wondered how to integrate work, family life, and your passion without missing a beat? Well, Tamika Isaac Devine is doing just that and showing others how to do it as well. We are talking about work-life balance and I'm doing some how do I do my day and then I put it down on the books. Tamika Isaac Devine is hard at work alongside Mayor Steve Benjamin in her role as Columbia's Mayor Pro Tem. When she's not at City Council, Ms. Devine teaches other women just how to do all she does. You're an author, you're a busy mom and, and working mom yourself. How do you fit it all in? So I think so many times people are stressing because they feel like I have to have that elusive work-life balance. There really is no such thing. And so what I say is I practice work-life integration, which is finding ways to, uh, to synergize what I'm doing, what my work responsibilities are, what my home responsibilities are, and finding a way that my family can work together to make sure that we're supporting each other in whatever we have to do. Tamika Isaac Devine, she is the Mayor Pro Tem of Columbia, South Carolina, and she sits on the City Council there. Councilwoman, thanks for joining us. Us. Thank you so much for having me. Do you think that Deval Patrick would be able to find a toehold in South Carolina? What would a, a run by him look like there? So I think it's very interesting. Um, Governor Patrick um, years ago would come to the state often. He actually was a uh, speaker at our annual uh, Democratic dinner. And so I think he has a lot of folks who would be intrigued by his candidacy. Uh, but what I do think is right now, time is really tight. Our primary is February 29th. And so uh, you'd be able to get ID, name recognition, ID, and really be able to uh, get people to really understand why he would be uh, the best choice um, outside of, you know, uh, Vice President Biden or others. I think he ha time is really, really short. So he's going to, if he comes, he's going to have to be here. Author and coach Tamika Isaac Devine is joining us this morning and she has some tips for us. Good morning. Good morning. So first of all, when we say have it all, what does that even mean? So what it means is actually, what is all to you? What are your priorities? Because I think so many times we're looking at trying to live up to what other people want. Mm -hmm. So figuring out what that means for you and then how can you achieve it? And because we're, we're trying to figure it out because part of the problem is if you don't have it figured out, not only are you just, you know, just all over the place, but it can take a toll on your health. Yes, uh, new studies show that stress is actually one of the leading causes of heart disease. And so, you know, we as women trying to balance it all, um, it causes a lot. And so I, want, I think there are a lot of tips that help us manage that stress and get us back to work-life integration. I kept getting people asking me kind of, Tamika, how do you do it all? And I realized that if more and more people consistently came to me asking about the same thing, that that was a void that maybe people weren't speaking to and actually mentoring and helping people with figuring out how can you still follow your professional dreams as well as have the things that you're passionate about and then also have a very happy and fulfilled home life. And so the Possibilities Institute just really grew out of that passion to want to help and support and empower other women on how do you have that type of lifestyle.